Hi, I'm Terry Walker. I'm a singer-songwriter. Hi, you're in my house. This is crazy. I've been songwriting actually for the past maybe 10 years probably, but singing and professionally since I was 18. I'm 21 now. <laughs> every morning or every night, my mum would just play music non-stop. And I'd wake up to music, I'd go to sleep to music. And you can see this is the evidence. My mum listens to everything. Gloria Estefan, Barry White, Chaka Khan, Maze. Oh my God, my mum used to be the biggest Star Council fan. I remember the first time I ever heard this record called Move Closer. Move closer, move your body real close until we... Listen, when I first heard those, those, that melody and the lyrics, I was like, who is this woman? I want to do that to people. I want to be able to make people feel that way she's making me feel right now. Those are like my earliest memories of me wanting to, wanting to do music. It's growing up as kids, we used to always sleep in this one bed. Ich bin in Deutschland, ich bin in England geboren, aber in Deutschland aufgewachsen. Und ich liebe Essen, ich liebe Musik, ich liebe Leute, ich liebe alles. All for my life, from the age of four until I was 18, I grew up in Germany, so Germany is a very heavy influence on me. The schönsten Songe, Songs der Supergruppe, which means they're the best songs of the supergroup, Eagles. These are actually my classmates in Germany. Oh my God, these are like my proper mates. My homeland is Jamaica. As a kid, the first time I went, I was nine with my granddad. And I was out there for six weeks. He took me down to um, where my mom grew up. We were out there in Jamaica, we would always sing Whitney Houston song. So we were singing, where do broken hearts go? Jamaicans love their ballads and they love their soul singers. and So that was something that we straight away connected on. As soon as I got to Jamaica, we connected on the music thing from the get-go. When I got back to England, I was speaking with a full-blown Jamaican accent. And my mum was like, oh my God. I was like, well, I got my mate. Da, 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 da. And she was like, oh, my child is like a yardie now. What the hell has happened? I love you, boy. <laughs> Uh, what I'm looking forward to is getting to know and understanding why I am the way that I am. Do you know what I mean? Because I think being Jamaican, I think us as people, we're very singy song, we're very confident, we're very, you know, just out there. And I think naturally I'm one of those people. And I think for me, I'm going to be very excited to kind of find out where that root is and where it came from and why we are the way we are, you know? So that's one thing I'm really looking forward to. Oh, the best thing about the home, my homeland, just the way that people kind of make something good out of even maybe not having that much, you know, and just um, the community, the way the way we root for our people, the way we just, we need a Jamaican, what, you're Jamaican, what, we're the best, we're the thing, do you know what I mean? I need closure. Making people are so fast, it's coming to your situation. That's right, we just need to be anyway, what's going on, what's going on, that's what I love about Jamaican, and I don't know him, but I feel like I know him. <laughs>